It was more than just the beginning of the season. It was the beginning of a new era in Bearcat basketball. A new chapter in the storied program was being unveiled. A new and improved Fifth Third Arena. I'd say this one is uh, a little bit ahead of uh, anything else that ever appeared on campus. This modest comparison comes from a man who was one of the very few to have been a part of all three on-campus arenas. Chuck Mayshock was a member of some of the great Bearcat teams that played in the old Armory Fieldhouse. Then he coached and broadcasted in the Shoemaker Center. And Wednesday night he watched the rebirth of the shoe, now known as Fifth Third Arena. And when asked to pick his favorite moment of all the arenas, it was easy. The opening of the first Fifth Third Arena, the Shoemaker Center, in 1989. And Andre Tate will try to get it in. He does, and it's the Sanders. He hits it. This is Hugs doing this. And he looked at Steve and he said, if these guys don't catch the ball, you just, wherever you stop and you're standing, when the ball is handed, you just run to the corner. And that's exactly what he did. He ran to the corner, got the ball, shot the ball, it went in, game was over. That was the biggest of all in my doings that happened in this building when I was on a team or coaching. Many great players from the past were on hand for the grand celebration, reminiscing of days gone by and looking at a bright future. Herb Jones sat with Chuck and said, what if? Herb came over, sat me and we were talking and he started bragging about what this would have done had he and his teammates had something like this to play on or to practice on. From the 60s to the 90s and now into the 20s, arenas will change, but there's one constant that continues to win championships. Uniform the same color, black and red most of the time, sometimes black and white, sometimes red and white, but it's still a Cincinnati basketball player. One who's going to study, who's going to get a degree, who's going to graduate and say, I played in that gym.